So hi, please tell us uh, about your name, uh, your title and what you were facilitating there during the symposium. Hi, uh, my name is Stefanos Fotiu. I'm uh, the director uh, in the Office of Sustainable Development Goals in FAO headquarters. I mean, this symposium uh, organizing a couple of sessions on food system transformations, their relations to the SDG, and how we follow up after the food system summit last year. Thank you. So, please tell us uh, what are the takeaways or any message uh, from the symposium and within especially your own area of expertise. So, one of the takeaways I, I get is that countries are looking at food system, agri food system transformation. So, uh, it is high in their agenda. It is very nice to see that it's high in their agenda. At the same time, I see that countries they are having requests. They say we need support to make these food system transformations happen. Uh, they need technology support, they need knowledge support, they need financial support. So I think that there's a very big momentum. We need to really um, take, take, the, take this momentum forward. We need to go from uh, planning and from ideas to action. And I think this could be done here because this is a very dynamic region that will define more or less the future of sustainable development in the world. Um, so what will be the future of this region or if you would like to add anything else on your, uh, about this question? I mean, ideally I would like to see a region that has achieved the sustainable development goals. Um, the current projections are not good. They do say that uh, the region is 30 to 35 years behind on achieving the SDG goals. But I think we can accelerate and there are some easy wins. So transforming agri-food systems could be a very big accelerator because the agri-food systems are connected with uh, a lot, if actually all the sustainable development goals. They are connected with the environment, with health, with, with poverty, with nutrition, with sustainable consumption and production. So I think if countries put at the center of their transformation policies the agri-food systems, we can see a big acceleration and hopefully this could be the future of Asia. Thank you very much. Anything else you would like to add? I think that in, in this part of the region we see a lot of innovation, we see a lot of growth, we see a lot of uh, uh, new entrepreneurs, new business, and I think it's nice that the different initiatives, uh, like the OCOP initiative of FAO, for example, that promotes green and, and new entrepreneurship, are taking and they're upscaled uh, at, at the countries. I think the potential is here. I think the private sector needs to step in and takes also its role on transforming the food systems and uh, put, put our money behind our mouth. Awesome. Thank, thank you very much. Thank, thank you very much. Great. Take your mic.